getting right. Welcome to Inconsistent Days, where every day in my life is inconsistent. You know hey, 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 I'm back again for another video. Today, tonight, I am making custard. I don't know how many of y'all love custard. Well, my grandfather loves custard. It's one of his favorite dishes, and I haven't made it in a while because he hasn't been wanting it, but lately he's been requesting custard, so I'm going to show you all how to make a quick and delicious custard. Custard is a really simple, easy recipe, and it's not complicated at all. So let's get started. For my recipe, I use four eggs. So I'm going to crack one. Two, three, two, four, four eggs. And I'm going to give them a whisk. Okay. One cup of sugar. And now I'm going to pour everything into this bowl. So I have one cup of sugar. Pour my eggs in there. Go ahead and kind of stir this up. One cup of sugar, four eggs. This is a really, really easy, quick custard recipe that your family will love if you guys are into custard. Now I'm going to take four cups of milk. So I love these little tumbler cups. They equal exactly one cup. So there's one, two, and three. I use four eggs and three cups of milk. Usually on a custard your eggs is equal to the number, the amount of milk you put in it, but for me, that extra egg, I don't know why, but it just, I think it makes it a little bit thicker. So I have <clears throat> four eggs, one cup of sugar, and three cups of milk, then a couple of tablespoons of vanilla. However much vanilla you want. They usually call for about two tablespoons of vanilla. Okay. And I'm going to whisk it up. And then after that, I'm going to pour it back into this yellow bowl that I had with the spout so it's easier to pour. Okay, I have five custard dishes over here. And um, <clears throat> in my pan, um, when you put your custard dishes in there, make sure that you fill your pan at least three quarters of the way up. Don't put water in your custard dishes, just in the pan that your custard dishes are sitting in. Okay, now I'm going to pour my custard in. Yum. He will ask for a custard every single day until these are gone, sometimes twice a day. He goes through these phases. All right, and there we go. That's it, that's all there is to custard. I put this in the oven, and I've already set my oven for like 300. So I'm gonna put it, there, put it in there for about 30 minutes. Usually it calls for 20 minutes. It really depends on your oven. My oven doesn't cook as well as a lot of ovens, so I'm going to put it in there for 30 minutes, and then and then I will check it to see if it's done. When it's done, it's going to be, it'll be firm. It, there won't be any jiggle, real jiggleness to it or anything. It'll be nice and firm. All right. Well, I hope you all enjoyed this quick, um, quick video on how to do a really good custard. All right. 
Thanks for watching. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.